my channel and welcome back to my kitchen yes it's another friday juice time with species 21 and it is our game for name that juice and hopefully guys we are going to have a winner today so today's juice time with me are Watermelon in American, watermelon in England, and beetroot, it's beet in Canada and United States, and beetroot in British English. Beetroot is a little bit um stingy so we will we are going to be very very careful upon using this one and we've got pomegranate so later on guys i'm going to tell you benefits um the vitamins and um the origin of the fruits and i hope you will going to learn as i learned when i was um, reading earlier so come on guys Let's prepare all the things. Guys, we're gonna wash the um, watermelon and I only need to use the half of this. And according to Google, um, the origin of watermelon has been traced back into the deserts of southern africa when it's still grown wild today the ancestor of modern watermelon is tough drought tolerant plant prized for its ability to store water for tribe crossing the kalahari desert oh my god it's from africa can't you believe that guys and now it's spread all over the world Next, guys, we're gonna wash the marmalade. And then we are going to cut this in half like that. Oh my god, the juice is coming out already. So it will be nice. Um, napakadali lang po niyan um, gaganituhin lang natin eh. very manually patiently at lalabas na po yan sila hi guys let's face the fact that I can't slice and read at the same time so originally the promeganate, one of the world's most ancient fruit, has had a long and fascinating history. Although it probably originated in Persia, cultivation spread out quickly throughout the Mediterranean and extended to Arabia, Afghanistan, India, and China, where it was called the Chinese apple, the alternate appellation. Wow! Yeah. Here's the result of two and a half. Ngayon na siya. So, pagtsatsagaan lang natin kunin yung mga, uh, yung mga white meat. Here we go, guys. Last but not the least is our beetroot na napaka-staining. Uh, so, mag-iingat po tayo. Una po ay i-separate po natin sila. Oh, well, um, right natin. guys, beetroot, origin and natin. production. Table beet is original from the Mediterranean, okay, Europe this, and North Africa. Later on it spread all over Europe and Western India, forming a secondary diversity center in the Near East. The European countries are great consumer of table beet. Oh my god, it's so similar with pomegranate. Can't believe it. So hey guys. So isn't it amazing? Our juice today is red. Sliced um, watermelon. Um, prepared for marinade. And um, just uh, 
that the top and the bottom of the um, beetroot. So guys, this is a little bit tricky and messy. So I put the um, bean bag already in my juicer. And I think I'm gonna do this first because we're gonna drain the um, the juice after. So good luck to us. This is my first time, so <sighs> be with me, guys. So what I am going to do is I'm going to load them all up here like this. So, are we ready? Ready. Come on then. Ilipad na naman po. Wow. It's like it's not needed to be drained. How quick. To make sure. And let's check. Um, out of our two and a half pomegranate, we only had 250, 250 ml or one and a half cups. Our beetroot is next. So here we go. I'm so scared. That's how ready it is. Oh my god. You see clearly. It's like blood. And I. It smells like. Um, it smells like. Uh, it's like a. Potato. Uh, or sweet potato and cook. Okay. I wonder what it tastes like. Oh my god, I'm so excited to try it. It's like the blood. See guys? Wow. Now, consolation prize of all. Alright guys, finally we finished the juice and I need to sit because I really need to hold a grip with this. First time in my life ever. I tried beetroot in salad but it was like uh, preserved na in a jar. That's Ito fresh talaga. So, good luck to Species 21. But I am strong. You're there. You're with me. So, before I'm going to try this, yeah, we, we, we've done a lot of out of two and a half and five, five pieces beetroot, two and a half pomegranate, and a half of um, watermelon. We got um, more than um, 1.5 um, ml or no, not ML. Is, is it Lisa? Uh, yeah, it is ML. Yeah, so the moment of truth. The smell is so earth. Uh, ground, the ground, earth. Very earthly. The beetroot is overpower spring. So I hope the watermelon will gonna taste better because that's what I am expecting. Um, right guys, so again, hopefully may nakahula and congratulations in advance um, kung sino man yung um, nanalo, kung meron man. Ayan, ito na talaga. Ha, huwag ko nang patagalin pa. Wow. The preparation and everything. 
It's worth it. Oh my God, the peeling, the, oh, I can't mention. You've seen it, guys, you've seen it. The taste is awesome. You can smell the earthy feeling of beetroot, but the taste of watermelon exploring, exploring more. And the impact of pomegranate, the kick of it, like uh, it's so yummy in total. Um, total. Uh, how are you gonna say? I'm speechless. It's so like I didn't expect this. Really, juicing, guys. I'm encouraging you to make some juicing because um, you'll never expect what it tastes like. Ibang iba sa juice na nabibili natin. I can't say any more anything else. It's just try it yourself, and you will find out the beauty, inner beauty of juicing. Honestly, guys, I'm speechless. It's really nice. Try it yourself. It's not too sweet. Um, just don't drop or spell in your grass or in your hair prone or anywhere else because it's really stainy. Uh, beetroot is a very, very powerful color. Oh my God, very red. It's scary, but it's nice. It tastes nice. Really, guys, really, really. It really, really tastes nice. So, bottoms up. Congratulations for myself! Congratulations myself and thank you very much for being with me and um, I hope someone guessed it and we'll see you next Friday. This is Species 21 and have a lovely day. Cheers guys! See you! Bye! Mm.